Welcome to Long Time No Play Double Dragon 3 The Sacred Stones for the NES. This is Ron Moore, and yeah, it's been about 15 years since I played this game. Not the best in the series, but uh, not a bad game. I liked it okay. Part 2 was much better. I think I got this for Christmas 93 or 92, somewhere around there. Yeah, there's the famous typo, Bimmy and Jimmy defeated the Shadow Warriors. <laughs> I don't think I noticed that typo when I was a kid. I probably didn't notice it until ABGN says something about it. So yeah, here's the storyline right here with the opening to Double... Whoa. Yeah, and uh, Heroku, Heruko, whatever, she always creeped me out when I was a kid. So she's telling us what's going on, where Marion is, and she's been kidnapped again. And then we start the game. Now, this is part one of the series uh, uh, you know, for Long Time No Play Double Dragon 3. And it's two player action. This is uh, Venom recording with him right here. But he is not with me in the commentary because he didn't really want to be a part of this game. He didn't really like it that much. Uh, and so, he is, uh, this is the only part where it's going to be two player action. After this, the rest of the Long Time No Play is going to be uh, one player action with me. He, don't, he didn't want to record any footage either after this, so this is the only time it's going to be two-player action. I'm uh, Bimmy, and uh, Venom is Jimmy, so there you go. And we are in stage one, the dojo, as we fight a bunch of Stone Cold Steve Austins. By the way, this microphone of mine lost its cover, or the top, or whatever, so if I sound weird or always blowing in the mic or whatever, and, you know, I apologize for that. So yeah, the, uh, this game right here, what's cool about this game though, you get to play as different characters later on in the game, which is pretty cool. I, I already thought that was cool back then. And so now we're outside of level 1 and more Stone Cold Steve Austins and uh, stoners or hippies, wherever they are. You notice in the bottom it says bare hands under uh, Billy and Jimmy, so you can use weapons in this game, bear bottles, knives, pretty much what you did in the other Double Dragons. And like I said, it's not the best in the series or for the NES, but I mean, I, I enjoyed it. Uh, when I was a kid, I was real happy when I got it for Christmas. I really thought I was cool because I got it. And I had to brag to my friends about it when I got went back to school after Christmas break. But it's not a bad game. And, and yeah, as you can tell, we are spamming the Cyclone Kicks because why not? It works in this game. The AI is not as smart. This game is not as challenging as Double Dragon 2. The one, uh, uh, this part, this port right here, I don't know about the Sega Genesis version. I know we did that on the S2K channel, or uh, it was Green's LP. But I promise you, this one will be audible. The commentary will be audible. Um, but yeah, uh, I don't know about the Genesis version, but this port of Double Dragon 3, the, the CPU, the AI, always pretty much always runs into your cyclone kicks it's ridiculous so we will be spamming that a lot in this part and I will be most likely spamming it throughout the entire game um, yeah me and a friend was talking about this in elementary school it was like man they run right into your spin kicks I said yeah I know right so yeah and uh, the soundtrack in this game uh, from what I remember is not bad Yeah, I think you do uh, more moves on here than you do in part uh, in Double Dragon 2 as well. I think like that little uh, move where I just jumped on him and flipped him over. That's pretty cool. And now you got these women from <laughs> it's like those women from Street of Race 3 on here now. Well, they might have also been in Double Dragon 2. I don't remember. Shameless plug. Check out me and J-Man's. Uh, I think it was a low budget let's play. Double Dragon 2 a while back on my channel or it might have been a We Shall Play on his channel I forgot but anyway yeah more spamming of the Cyclone Kicks I'm trying not to call it Hurricane Kicks this is not Street Fighter and oh, oh Venom what are you doing you should have stopped <laughs> he told me right there he could not stop for whatever reason he could not stop I don't know if it's awkward controls or it's just an error on his part, but anyway, he is gone, and that's what sucks about this game right there. It's already game over, 
when you die one time? Really? That's pretty. That's pretty lame. Come on, man. So in a sense, this game can be more harder than Double Dragon 2. Now we're in the final part of the first stage. <laughs> Makes me feel like I'm playing Mega Man here. It looks like you're in a Mega Man type stage, and the music seems Mega Man-ish. Anyway, come on. And sometimes I'm failing to do the side. Oh yeah, because I've had a freaking beer ball on my hand. That's why I couldn't do the freaking cyclone kick. Hello. Oh, here we go. Yeah, I think I'm better off doing the cyclone kicks, just spamming the whole time. Spamming that same move. It works. Oh, yeah, you might say, well, it's not a real strategy, Ronnie. Well, if you can you know, make it simple, stupid. I mean, don't use strategy if you don't need it. There we go. You gotta watch out. They're running, jump after you. Oh, come on. You're supposed to run right into my cyclone kicks. What happened? See right here, I'm having trouble doing that. Come on. Wow. Oh, here we go. We fight the boss of the stage, Star Soldier. Oh, yeah, baby. Your spamming cyclone kicks ain't gonna work on me. <laughs> Man, I got them hands. Oh, look at that. Well, I just got pwned. All right, stay state power. All right, here we go. Now, me and Venom are back. This time I got some help. It's like fighting Jay and Star Soldier's love child. <laughs> oh man, Jay's gonna kill me. Alright, so it looks like Ray Jackson from Blood Sport. Except Ray wasn't that quick. Yeah, watch out. This guy has quick hands. Just keep spamming the cyclone kicks. Almost never fails. He kinda looks like the first boss from Double Dragon 2, except uh, he don't have a mask and doesn't disappear. Come on. There we go. Yes. Oh, oh, that'd be funny if you could hear by accident, quote unquote. Well, we'll see you guys in part two. God bless and take care.